Hi, it's Monday, April 4th. We got to plant some peppers real quick to backfill where the critters took them out, but I needed to anyhow. We needed a couple of jalapenos for our canning that's coming up this summer. I do want to report that we did get the hot wire in. It took me a day to recover. We'll show you what happened there. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to touch it too many times. So far the hot wire has been successful. I'm going to be spending most of the afternoon getting the hot wire up and complete. Alright, let's get this fence in. I've been pounding on this one for a little bit. I think I got through the rock pretty close. That's about as far as that one's going in. There you have it. Ground wire's as deep as they're going to go. Now what we did was we took the hot wire from the bottom all the way around the garden to the gate, back all the way around the garden back to the gate, tensioned it up. Then we took a ground wire around the middle, drove, we drove ground posts in, in two places. We connected them together and connected them to the ground wire and then connected it back to the controller. The hot wire we connected straight from the controller to the top wire which made it makes a full circuit. We have two handles bottom ones the hot middle ones the ground so we can get into the garden. We strung it all the way around the entire garden. Now of course I have to test it. Thunderstorm is a coming. You gotta be love being under the edge of an anvil. That thunderstorm is gonna be on us shortly. I don't think this charger's work. Ah. Ah. Oh, yeah, Whew. it's working. It's working. Just another Oklahoma rainstorm. Little hail in it. If you want to become one of my subscriber submission team and have me highlight what you're doing at your home, message me on Facebook. Love to see what you're doing. Now is the fun time. As everything starts growing, loose around the squash, tight around the post. Just give it a little support. Come on, let's plant. Let's go plant garden.